is Mari from Namaste Mari, and it is Monday Morning Rambles. Um, I hope you guys had a good weekend. I relaxed for most of it. I worked, but I did relax because remember last week I had mentioned that I was having oral surgery. I was hoping that it would just be one or two of my wisdom teeth, but it ended up being all four, two, two. And yeah, at my mouth, the first day, I was so puffy, like my mouth was so swollen, my cheeks were so big, and then I got new glasses. So I kept joking that my glasses were so big and my cheeks were so big that I looked like Janet from the Chipmunks. Remember Janet? She had like the big cheeks and the glasses. So yeah, I felt like her for most of the week. I've been living off of like ramen and like my mom rocks. She made me some homemade um, chicken noodle soup that she pureed for me because obviously I couldn't like chew on the carrots and the potatoes so she just, she just pureed, pureed it which is great because fun fact about me I love baby food and I never stopped eating baby food so the fact that it kind of resembled baby food was perfect for me um what else happened but yeah I'm feeling better yesterday was the first day that I actually ate chicken like I took chicken out the freezer and defrosted it and actually ate chicken which is awesome because I miss eating people, I miss chewing on food, it's, yeah, I really do, I'm, I'm making chicken today for lunch, so hopefully it's good, and I'm sorry I keep like salivating, it's just, my gums are still very swollen, so, and, and I'm on painkillers, so this is like a drunk dial, Monday morning rambles, who knows what comes out of my mouth today, the truth, who knows, I don't know, and what else is happening, I picked the winner for my mighty nuts, powdered peanut butter giveaway yeah that just happens so i picked the winner thank you for everyone who um entered my contest you guys rock thank you so much um you're not saying the early bird catches the worm i guess it holds true because i i try to be as fair as possible and i use the random number generator so i ch i put how many comments i had picked the random number it was comment number three who is the first person to comment because she did she followed the rules or he followed the rules your name is math mahna math mana math mana you're the winner um follow the rules i said for everything that you do it's a different entry so if you follow me on instagram or you follow me on twitter if you follow them mighty not on instagram twitter comment separately remember i said that for each one because it increases your chances to win and math mana you won please email me at mari at namaste mari the link is on my website to my email email me so and tell me your mailing address and also what flavor you want you have the choices of original vanilla chocolate and the one with the i believe it was the chia and flax seeds and you get the cool little measuring cup it is two tablespoons in that measuring cup so you just use one scoop and that's a serving size yeah it's awesome if you guys hear a squeaky sound I don't have mice, well not that I know, even though last night I had a dream that I had a rat. I have to check my dream book to see what that means. But if you guys hear that squeaky sound, the heat is rising in the building because it's like, it's like 30 something degrees outside. So yeah, it sounds like mice. I'm That noise must have infiltrated in my dream last night because I had a dream that I, ha I, I had a mat and it was elevated and when I moved it, a rat ran out. So yeah, I think that drink, that noise got it. Do you see what I'm saying about recording with freaking painkillers? It's not going to work because I ramble as it is. And then this is just worse. Um, yeah, so that's that. What else is happening? Oh, so technically I finished the oxygen challenge, which sucked because the last week was like the good week and I couldn't work out last week. I had to take off my, they took out my wisdom teeth on Tuesday. So the first workout that i did was sunday morning yesterday which was like yoga and spin so i ended up just i guess stopping but it's okay because i am redoing it i started it again today this morning because i like to keep things interesting and i like to challenge myself it's something that i just like to do i like to i like to have a goal i like to have a purpose it was if it's either training for the New York City Marathon or doing a challenge for Oxygen Magazine, whatever it is. Anyways, like remember there were two trainers. It was Amanda Latona and Erin Stern. This time around, I'm gonna try out Erin. 
Um, I did one of her workouts this morning. Depending how I feel, I might stick with just Erin, but I really do love Amanda's workouts so much that I might merge them together. Like if it's a leg day, I'll look at both programs and see what muscles they're targeting. Fun fact, that when you're a trainer, you can figure out how to make your own thing. So I'll see what if it's like a hamstring day or like quads or whatever. And maybe I'll just merge both programs together and see how that works, but we'll see. Um, yeah, I just like Amanda. Like, I love her vibe. Her videos are awesome. Like, if you check out her Instagram, she just has, has something about it I just love. And I love the program. I love the way it made me feel. So I might stick to Erin or merge them together. Same thing with the food. Might merge them. Stick with it. Just follow my macros and see what my carbs, protein, fat intakes are for the day or where they should be and just work around that. Um, I have to go to Trader Joe's. I need so many groceries. My phone. Ugh. Anyways. Um, I, I didn't even realize. Did you guys notice that it was ringing this whole time? Because I didn't notice. Anyways, I have a voicemail and a phone call. Um, what else is happening? So yeah, doing that program again. Pick the winner for Eat Mighty. I'm sorry, Mighty, not hashtag Eat Mighty. I actually have a recipe that I want to try. I wanted to try it this week, but I didn't because obviously I can't really chew and it's something that I want to make. Um, hopefully, I get to Trader Joe's this week because there's something I have in mind that I want to make. I'm not going to give it away yet. And if it does turn out as good as that, you know when you want to cook something and you have it in your brain, how great it's going to taste? And then sometimes it does, it's a hit or miss. But I'm hoping that what I want to make is going to turn out as awesome as I think it is and I will be sure to share the recipe this next Monday morning rambles so check out look out keep a lookout for that do you guys like my new glasses I'm getting used to them I have to you know like the, the whole depth perception is off when you get new glasses and my other ones were more square so these are more to the side so I have to like make sure like for right now it feels like almost like um fish tank view so I have to get used to them so yeah you guys aren't going to get those 30 seconds back of your life I just robbed them from you for explaining how my perception of my new glasses feel but yeah I think I'm going to go now because I have to see who just called me and I have work to do and I kind of want to sneak down and do laundry I live in a building and it's like you have to like run down and make sure no one's washing clothes so you can use machines and I don't smell like the laundry room is right down the courtyard and I don't smell anything drying so that's a good sign. So hopefully no one's down there right now. Again, something. I'm sorry. I've stolen so many minutes of your life this morning. And I apologize for that. You know. But whatever. It is what it is. So yeah. Alright. I'm going to go now. Um, Math Mahna. Math Ma I really do suck at saying your name. Math Mana. Math Mana. There we go. Please email me. So I can get this shipped out to you. Um, and yeah, I guess everyone have an awesome day. And as always, my loves, namaste. Bye. I can't even smile. My cheeks get so big because they're so swollen. Okay. Namaste. Bye. <laughs>